Captain Aaron Delida, and I'm a flight commander at the 10th Air Support Operations Squadron. Yeah, so Red Flag is a basically simulated air war um, that has um, different components from different joint partners. Um, there's Army components and then obviously ground air force and air components um, that all kind of have to work to integrate into a single campaign or operation um, against a, I guess, multifaceted enemy. So we play into the big picture uh, mostly with air ground integration. Um, we have kind of have a unique opportunity here to plan with some of the flyers that we don't usually get because we're more uh, centered with the Army and stationed with the Army and doing the planning with the Army staff elements. Um, so we kind of work that piece. We bring the Army perspective into this um, and how the air planning and the, the fighters would fit into the overall ground scheme and maneuver to uh, meet the ground commander's intent. Um, it was a little slow today on our side because the pilots had some air-to-air -air conflict that they had to deal with prior to coming to us on the ground. Um, but it was good for us to see because obviously you won't always be getting the assets that you're fragged out to get because they're dealing with a lot more than we see down here on the ground. We deal more with the ground scheme maneuver and they have to contend with some other factors before they get to us. I hope my team takes away the perspective of planning and working directly with the air crew and I hope that we can take that and take it back to home station to kind of incorporate when we work with our army echelons to kind of better incorporate a bigger, more, a wider view of the joint force and, and how they operate and bring a different perspective into that, those exercises that we'll have later down the road. In the conventional sense, I think we're still gaining that perspective and getting a better understanding of some of the limiting factors that could face uh, like our pilots that we work with and that we control and we control ordnance off of. Um, so even in missions like this, just being out here and, and doing the planning is a big part of the success and we get to do that every day of Red Flag. So the planning is a big part of it. Uh, so we fit into global power conflict at, mostly at the later stages. Um, we come into play when enemy forces and friendly forces have kind of closed and are in, in closer quarter battle. Um, we deal primarily with releasing weapons off jets in close proximity to friendly forces, um, and that requires a lot of detailed integration um, on our end and with the pilots. Um, so we don't deal so much with the earlier stages of the GPC, but as the, the war evolves, that's where we come into play. Uh, because we primarily deal with employing weapons at decisive points and ensuring that friendly forces stay alive. 